Hi, this is Mistress Jane, and these are your Commerce Exam Nuggets, Lesson Number 3, Specialization and Division of Labor. Before we begin, I will quickly ask you to get the following pen or a pencil, a notebook or device, and of course, your thinking cap. Here are our objectives for our lesson for today. Objective one is to define the term specialization or division of labor. Our second objective is to look at the disadvantages and advantages, stating one of each. Now let's do a quick recap of our last lesson of production. Do you remember the three main categories, primary, secondary, and tertiary? Every possible occupation is going to fall under one of those three levels. Hairdresser, baker, flat nursery worker, insurance agent, oil refinery, carpenter, all of those are going to fall into one of those three levels. Because of that, that's leading us straight to our term and topic for today. What is specialization? Specialization is the breaking down of a productive activity into simpler tasks. Let's take a look at your keywords. Did you know it is also known as the division of labor. You can use those terms interchangeably. Now the advantages versus the disadvantages. Our advantages are as follows. One, increased output. Two, skills are developed. And three, mechanization. Remember at least one of these. Then there's the disadvantages. Boredom interdependence and machinery replacing labor unemployment let's do a quick recap can you define specialization what about stating one of the advantages or one of the disadvantages Great job, wow, it's just that simple. I wanna to pause to thank you for watching. And remember, with God, virtually anything is possible.